India is an adventurous paradise. You head out for a holiday, which quickly turns into a survival situation. A dream turns into a nightmare. I'm thirsty, I'm tired, I'm hungry and I'm lost. Shelter, water and food become a priority. A fire to keep you warm. But how? I'm Chandan Lahiri from OTS Survival School. I'll give you some tips and show you some tricks to use in a self-reliant situation. Do not think problems can only happen to other people. It can happen to you. I'm on this trek up this hillside and another 300 feet if I rise up in altitude, I would be at 10,000 feet. And that's getting into high altitude area. In fact, high altitude starts at about 8,000. We've all heard about high altitude. What is high altitude? In fact, high altitude can be graded in three segments. You've got high altitude, which starts at about 8,000 feet, goes up to about 12,000 feet. That's high altitude. Then you get into very high altitude, which is 12,000 to 18,000 feet. beyond 18,000 feet is extremely high altitude, an altitude which some call the dead zone, because the body does not acclimatize beyond 18,000 feet. So high altitude is still an enigma. Not too many people know why the body goes through certain things that it does when you're getting into high altitude areas. But what you need to be careful about is that the body will certainly undergo certain chemical changes when you're getting into higher and higher reaches. And when you're heading up into the mountains, you need to be aware of what high altitude is. So just remember, eight to 12,000 feet, that's where high altitude starts. Then you get into 12 to 15,000, that's another segment, which is very high altitude. Beyond 18,000 feet, is extremely high altitude. So be very careful, don't take chances with altitude. Because if you're not careful, high altitude can kill you. So be very careful when you're heading out into the hills and when you look at this gorgeous scenery and you're nestled right in the middle of it, then it's very easy to not take precautions, not to be, not be careful that's when problems will start and you could actually get into a lot of difficulty including fatalities. People have been known to die in just a couple of hours because they were not careful, because they were not aware of what high altitude is all about. So this is where I am at 10,000 feet in the middle of the high altitude zone which is eight to 12,000 feet. And I'm gonna be heading up <clears throat> and I'm gonna be very careful. And so should you, because high altitude is a wonderful place to be, but it can also be a deadly place to be. And if you're at altitude and you're heading into higher reaches, into the Himalayas, if you're not careful, you can fall sick and you can die, and it can happen to you. Learn to adapt, improvise, innovate, and overcome. To learn more tips and tricks, visit this site. I'm Chandan Lahiri, and I hope to see you soon at the OTS Survival School. Leave nothing but footprints, bring back nothing but memories.